just don't know the way that I should go. I follow Jesus, I follow Jesus He's always helping me, He's strong when I am weak I follow Jesus, I follow Him I'm gonna walk, walk, walk like Jesus And I wanna go are tasty. It's true. And we can be a good friend and share what we have, too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Hoo, hoo. Follow me through. Follow me through. Hoo. I've got a Bible story for me and you. Hola, friends. 
Yes, I am Luis, the handyman. I'm getting ready to do something very fun today with my friends. I have special boots and a picnic basket. What do you think I'm going to do? <laughs> That's right, I'm going to go on a hike. I will wear my hiking boots to help me on the trail. And when we get to the top, we're going to have a picnic. Hmm. I hope I have enough food. <laughs> hey, that reminds me of today's story. Do you want to help me build it? Great, let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now, we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Today's true story from the Bible begins on a beach. Jesus and his friends had been working really hard. They were tired. Everybody yawn with me like you're so sleepy. Very good. <laughs> Jesus and his friends had planned to rest, but when they got to land, they found a huge crowd of people. There were more than 5,000 people. They wanted to see Jesus and hear him teach. You think Jesus taught the people? Well, of course, because Jesus is a good friend to everyone. Jesus taught for a long time and everyone was getting hungry. Jesus' friends, the disciples, told Jesus to send the people away so they could eat. But Jesus said to the disciples, you feed them. The disciples didn't know how to feed everyone. There were so many people. So Jesus told the disciples to go and see how much food they could find. When the disciples came back, they had, huh, how many loaves of bread did they find? One, two, three, four, Five. Five loaves of bread. And how many fish did they find? One, two, two fish. So they had five loaves of bread and two fish. Is that enough food to feed over 5,000 people? Let's find out. <laughs> Jesus took the food and prayed. He thanked God for the food they had. Then Jesus told the disciples to pass out the food to everyone. Hmm. Oh, how many of you got food? Oh, is anyone still hungry? That's so amazing. Jesus fed everyone with five loaves of bread and two fish. Jesus made sure that everyone had food to eat. Jesus was a good friend to everyone. And everyone can be friends with Jesus. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who can be friends with Jesus? Everyone can be friends with Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now, let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can be friends with Jesus? Everyone can be friends with Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus shared the food with everyone, and he wants us to share with our friends, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, Jesus used just two fish and five loaves of bread to feed so many people. Jesus is a good friend to everyone. Everyone can be friends with Jesus. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! <gasps> I know! I'm going to make something with my blueberries to share with everyone. See you next time. Bye! Come and follow me. 
Jesus said? Matthew 4, 19. Come and follow me, Jesus said. Matthew 4, 19. Thank you.